Look, look, look here, folks. Bobby Burnt Biscuit Smurder has touched down at the so-called prison systems. And now he's out. And the way he got out is he got in a private jet. Picked up by the, the most famous sellout group called Amigos, the little tight little bitty jackets. Picked up Smurder, put him on a plane. Ain't no telling where they went out there. And then a video surfaced later on on Bobby Smurder Instagram with the Migos based up there, giving them at least like a million dollars right there. And I told y'all this, man. These sellouts got way more than what people think. Like, it's just not what they got, but they the ability to get out and still maintain and get money because they're a sellout. And this dude did if that was just a Kentucky fried country eating man did some some crimes like that and popped out on people they would never see the light of day they wouldn't know what the light of day would be like they'd be in concrete under the prison cells and that's why sellouts how they have it good because they can actually get away popping people and do a little time supposedly like I feel like I feel like this dude haven't did any time. I feel like he manipulated everybody. And you know what I'm saying? The same little dude that popped so many people in the GS9 group. He's out here getting millions of dollars right now. As soon as he get out. Cause the sellouts are all them waiting on him. And I told y'all this man. You see all these cats getting out of jail, man, something ain't right. Just like Kodak the Black Bear, man. He got out of prison, you know what I'm saying? And he looking all different and stuff, but I really think that this uh Bobby Schmurter, the biscuit head, man, is probably a walking clone. No doubt about it. Because if you if you got out of jail from doing all this, man, something ain't right. What what gives them a privilege to get out and then you got regular country folk or Kentucky fried chicken eating sandwich eating boys out here putting in work popping and they going to jail for the rest of their lives cause they ain't no sellout and see the judge and all of them man they all sold out man the police and, you know what I'm saying the lawyers and all man they be throwing up subliminal signs in the courtroom people don't really catch it and I just be like dang even they even got the Freemason um like the uh, how the how the building made just like the Freemason man tables towels and everything man. The judge got a whole dress on a gown man. You know what I'm saying? Like what gives him authority to judge you? And I know some criminals need to be locked up, but these guys, these rappers man, it is a crime shame of what these guys getting away with. And I be feeling like. This dude got to be replaced, man, for, you know what I'm saying? They let this guy out. And it was all planned, man. That's why I say the e cash man, was never in jail, man. Like, this dude had to come straight from a cloning center, man, because I'm pretty sure that the cloning center messed this clone up just like they did that Kodak Blackbird clone. And you're going to see the uh, destructions on his face when these clones be walking around, man, like real live demons and stuff. And it, you know what I'm saying? And I feel like, man, people getting cloned themselves because I seen a dude look just like me. Yeah, man. He was on prison, man. Dude had popped like so many people. Dude was going to jails. And he looked at just like me. And I be figuring, like, we go to these checkups at the hospital, man. What they doing with this blood, man? You know what I'm saying? They cloning everybody and stuff. Yeah, all these guys look like me and all this, man. I'm telling you, man. These rappers are getting replaced. I believe they getting cloned and replaced. You know what I'm saying? That's why they let these guys out. You see, 2021, all these crazy rappers and with bad, you know, cases on them getting out of prison, man. So-called prison. You see the GS9, Bobby Smurder dude. He already getting millions that we speak. You know what I'm saying? Like Migos up there butting them up and all this, man. You know what I'm saying? They probably really snatched this dude butt crumbs. You know. Dark butt cones and shit, you feel me? So how many brothers get a private jet when they get out of jail? Come on, man.
So half the cats be walking home when they get out of jail. And that's why I say these sellouts got way more privileges, man. Cause they'll sell out, they get they get out of jail. Or they get released, or a clone get released. They get released with millions of dollars, man. Exactly, man. But hey, well, let, me, let me know what y'all think about this, uh, this Bobby Smurder, man, the burnt biscuit head, man, you know what I'm saying, you know what I'm saying, you know, burnt up clone, you feel me, let me know in the comment box, this is the Messy Robot, and I'm out.